What's happening, everybody? Uh, Get your pit here. A small comic book haul. Uh, an eBay win. So I'm just going to kick off straight away with Hellspawn number one. Bendis did an amazing story on this. You should really check this out. The artwork. I love the artwork in this. I'll crack it out. Let's see. see this is all the way through the save the artwork is like this, and it is amazing. Absolutely check that out. And then we've got a uh, from Re DC Rebirth, Harley Quinn number four. Still collecting this run. I love this cover. This is the Vermin cover. Uh, such a nice image. Uh, so. Oh, Batman. <laughs> it's a stamp. Batman stamp. I got that off a friend from school. I used to go to school with. I forgot about that. I was in the pub. And we were on about comics. And she said, Oh, when my son's got this little stamp, Batman stamp. I was like, I love that. Uh, next one is. Oh, sorry. Such an issue. Allergies. Uh, Shadow of the Bat, number one. This is the collector set. Now, when I bought, I've got this off eBay. Obviously, um, when I bought, I did, did know it was open, but everything is there with it. I checked it all out. So, what you get in this collector set? I'm going to try and find one that's not open. I'll just pull everything out. So you get. The comic, very good. Don't chuck it on the floor, Peter. You get blueprints of uh, Arkham Asylum, which I thought was really neat. You get a pop up. I can pop up. It's really cool. And a bookmark. That's what you get in a collector set. It's awesome. So, the next one. And um, I sent uh, JPL Flash a message on this because he got this the same day from the same place. Uh, if you go on eBay, check out um, the Place in Space comics. Absolutely amazing value. Um, I told him I got the same comic as he did, exactly the same day. And it is Spider Man, Spider Man 300. The True Believers. Now, I like these True Believers. And you know what? I don't mind reprints at all. Um, if you see me, the last haul, I've got um, Uncanny X Men, There's a Future Past. Um, and that was a reprint that come off a Marvel Legends or something like that. And I don't mind them because if you just start out collecting comic books, it's a good way to fill in the gaps. Uh, it's not going to cost you a fortune. And I say, these true believers, what we go for like, if you go on a place in space, like two quid, two quid a copy. And this is amazing. So, yeah, honestly, I, I have no gripes with that at all and like people say well yeah but it's not like the original but yeah it is exactly the same as the original it's just not worth the money that the original's worth but you get the same comic and you ads and, you know and you're paying like pennies for them so anyway yeah Venom vs Spider-Man Spider-Man 300 there you go and this is me bear with um, if you see one of my other videos I'm trying to click the Hellraiser graphic novels. Uh, this is a uh, trade paper, no, it's single issues, I think. So, anyway, yeah, I've got a uh, fly back as Hellraiser two and three, and I won this for a tenner. Can't go wrong with that, can you? And I just, uh, which one what was this one? Oh, there's book two. I say, and since it's come from Clive Back, and like, he's my favorite, one of my favorite authors. I love Hellraiser. Plus, the artwork is just phenomenal. 
So each story's got different artwork, so uh, that's the first story. You see the artwork there. Let's buy some seven bytes. Second story there. Like I said, different artwork each time. Them ones are from the 1990s, so I'll be looking out for number one and then onwards from there. But yeah, that's me coming card for now. Um, please comment below, tell me what you like, tell me what you're collecting, um, give us a sub and a thumb, and I shall see you all later.